Hey guys, and welcome to another episode tutorial of Logic Pro Mix Tips and Tricks. It's your man Reggie B here, Engineer of Peak Cliff Records LLC, and we're gonna jump right into this one. Um, somebody emailed me recently and asked if I could do a tutorial or a quick review um, of the H Delay plugin for Waves. So that's what I'm gonna do today. Um, let's so let's get right to it. For the most part, uh, this is a song here uh, that I mixed for an artist by the name of Jordan Clare. Um, you can find him, uh, you can find this song rather on um, his SoundCloud page. I'll put the link in the description so you can check that out. But uh, one of the things you want to do, well, one of the things I do is always I have a whole lot of auxiliaries. You want to definitely make use of auxiliary channels. Uh, because you never want to put too much effects directly on a audio channel, and you can't really gauge how much of it you want to shine through your mix and all that. So I like to use my auxiliaries. So the first thing I'm going to do is, this is the lead vocal here. I'm going to send this uh, with a bus to 9, because it's open. And here, in Logic, is where we will adjust the volume for that particular auxiliary channel so here I always just hold option key and click left click that brings it automatically to nominal so nominal volume 0 DB so now when I go over to bus 9 it's going to be over here bus 9 shows up here and this is auxiliary channel 12 so Here's where all my plugins can be, of course, brought in. So here I want to go here, go down to audio units, go down to waves, and we're going to bring in our H delay plugin. Okay, now here you have the H delay stereo, H delay mono. Doesn't really matter. But most times with delays, you want to use stereo. At least I like to, anyways. So here we have the H delay waves plugin. Uh, and of course it looks to me just like mostly any other generic delay um, you've got your delay time bar here which you can adjust um, feedback uh, you gotta now this is different most delays that I've seen don't have a filters here with a low pass and a high pass so that's something that's different that could be useful um, as it relates to this mix this here is pretty cool too. They have a tap tempo function. Now here the tempo of this song is 110, um, uh, 110 uh, BPM. So here you can see that once I open the plugin it automatically synced to 110 BPM to match. But here I'm, I'm imagining you can tap this and adjust and it'll adjust the BPM. So that's pretty cool. Um, modulation rate and depth um, most most delay plugins have that you got your dry wet uh, your output analog and a little uh, window here so for the most part it looks like a simple a simple delay plugin um, so let's test this thing out so I'm gonna play the track without it first so I'm gonna play just this uh, vocal soloed No, I don't care, no, I don't care, Yo. no, no, like, like, I go deeper than the deep end, deep end got deep me locked end. out like a precinct, precinct. <laughs> I don't do this often, but I'ma make a earn it like the weekend. Okay, so you can see I already have a lot of things on this track, on this vocal track already. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to play it dry for you, so that way there you can really hear what's going on so let's take out all of the effects real briefly just so you can hear how this sounds okay no i don't care no i don't care Yo. no no like i go deeper than the deep end, deep end. got deep me locked out like a precinct, precinct. <laughs> i don't do this often but i'm gonna make a earn it like the weekend okay so that's the track raw no effects, no anything on that. Um, so you, you could definitely tell the difference too between the things I put on it and make it a lot brighter and more um, 
brought more presence into the local. Um, but, okay, so now let's incorporate this delay and start having a little bit of fun. So, with a delay, the thing, the first thing I always adjust with a delay is the actual delay knob. That'll be the first thing that I take care of. Um, because you, you want to make sure your timing is correct. So that's the first thing that I'll take care of. So let me play it. I go deeper than the I go deep deeper than the deep end. Got me locked out, got me locked out like a precinct. Like precinct. precinct. I don't do this. I don't do it, but I'ma make her earn it like the weekend. weekend. Get it? Get she it? Work harder she work harder on the weekday, 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 so she ain't messing with the cliche. Messin cliche. With the cliche. Wow. Keep her love running like a love relay. Like a relay. Uh, round one, uh, round two, round two, replay, replay. Let me get it. Let me get it. Just a piece. Watch the tape like a delay. She said that she do that. She like, oh my, oh my God, why you doing this? Don't call me Don't Remy, call me Go ahead and pull another shot of Henny, So, for me, uh, I know that was a lot. For me, it, 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 it would sound good at uh, one, one over four uh, is where it would sound about right to me to put that, uh, that delay. Uh, uh, as far as these filters and things go, you could play with that as you feel. Of course, as a mix engineer you adjust it accordingly. What you want, what you don't want, you take out. So let's do that. I go deeper than the deep end. Deep end. Got me locked out like a precinct. precinct. <laughs> I don't do this. I don't do often, this. Often, but I'ma make her earn it like a weekend. Get it? Get she it? Harder she on the weekday, so she say she ain't messing with, with the cliche. Wow. Keep her love running, like, love like, a love running like a relay. Uh, round one, round, round two, round two, replay, 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 replay. Watch the tape like a delay, delay. Now this feedback tab, as you see when you adjust it further up, the more repeats you have. So that's pretty cool. The more actual delays you will get when you adjust the feedback. I go deeper than I go the deeper deep than the deep end. Got me locked, got me locked out like a precinct. precinct. I don't do this, I don't do often, this often, but I'ma make her, I'ma make her like earn it like the weekend. Get it? Get she it? Work harder she on the weekday, so she ain't messing with the cliche, cliche, cliche. And also with these things now, I, I'm just going through it myself. Um, tweaking it as I like, but you, you remember there's also always some presets, and a lot of times you can hit it right on the head with these presets, um, you know, and, and you won't even have to do anything but little small minor adjustments. So here they have presets like basic, which will give you a basic delay. So that's so that's a, a nice thing because you know sometimes you don't feel like sitting here going through the hard factor of trying to get get everything right. So you can set set it to a basic stereo preset. Pretty dope. So one of the things that's great about bringing your track to an auxiliary channel um, is the ability to control the volume elsewhere so here's my lead vocal right so i sent it bus 9 over to auxiliary channel 12. so when i go to auxiliary channel 12 there's my h delay plugin now watch how i can adjust this delay i go deeper than the deep end, deep end got me deep locked end. out like a precinct, precinct. <laughs> I don't do this often, but I'ma make her earn it like the weekend. Get it? She work harder on the weekday, so she say she ain't messing with a cliche. Wow. Keep her love running like a relay. Uh. Round one, round two, call it replay. <laughs> Let me get it just for peace sake. And that's how the H delay plugin works. So now, in its single singular setting, where we have, you know, the track soloed out, it may not sound as appealing. But when we bring back in everything, let's see how that that plugin will come to life and really bring presence uh, to this track. Care, no, I don't care, no, I don't care, no, no, like, like. I go deeper than the deep end, deep end got me deep locked end. out like a precinct. <laughs> I don't do this often, but I'ma make her earn it like the weekend. Oh, so I 
locked up like a precinct. I don't do this often, but I'ma make her earn it like the weekend. Get it? She work harder on the weekday, so she say she ain't messing with a cliche. Keep her love running like a relay. Round one, round two, call it replay. So, and that's nice. You can hear the little delay in the end. So that's my H delay plugin review. Um, I think it's a good delay. I wouldn't use this on all vocal tracks. Uh, it's just today. Um, you know, I decided to use it on this vocal, but this seems like a really good plugin that you could use on an instrument and get a really nice delay sound. And as you can see on the vocal, it does something great to it too. Uh, a lot of times it's subtle changes that make big differences. So something like this, H delay, nice and small, subtle. Um, but you know, it covers those gaps in the mix. So that's it for today, guys. Any questions, uh, hit me up at my email. And I'll definitely do a video tutorial for you. Um, and that's that. Later.